What's up internet? Call here from Final Wombat back at it again with another video for Finding Wombat. So, I got some very exciting news. It's very late. Okay, so I got some news. Some very good news. I finally got my hands on the Xbox Series X. Yes, I beat and I beat the scalpers. I did not go I did not go to them. I actually played the game for three days. And I got one. Came in the mail in a nice hefty box. And I just Still flabbergasted as to how I got it because I was honestly barely even trying. I was at work and I was like, no, screw it. I'll just try, even though I'm like super busy right now. I'm just on my phone. We got terrible signal. And it's like, all right, refresh at the cart, refresh at the cart, refresh at the cart, at the cart, check out, yada, yada, yada. And then it just went to, I was like, just freaking excited. So without any further ado, Let's get right to it. So, here we are, right here. The box. And also, with the nerd that I am, I am going to use a Batman knife to open this up. So, let's cut him open. I think we can do it this way. Also, um, I want to give like a nice, hefty, big shout out to the Twitter accounts. Uh, well, I don't know exactly by name, but I will put their names in the description So you too if you haven't got one yet in your fuse to get the scalpers the money Which I highly recommend that you guys do do not give them your money <laughs> All right, so uh, I just opened up this first lip and it says like mm, Well, like this, this is the first thing that I see just Look at that and then Microsoft up here up the top. But anyways, back to the Twitter accounts that I've like used to like the the, the alerts. There's one, like the first one that I've known was Wario 60, Wario 64, not 69. It's Wario 64. He does like no restock alerts and, oh, I'm sorry, okay, hold on. Just one more time, look at this. I'm pretty, okay, so I'm pretty sure you guys have already seen like Xbox unboxings and whatnot, but like here on Fighting Mama, we've done one before. It's like a little, a quick short one. And Jelani already has his Series X and PS5, but we didn't do an unboxing for that because the whole freaking distance that we have right now. But this is my reaction. So this means a lot to me and for like Fighting Mama. So I've been trying to do this for the Wombats. So this is my genuine impression on this. So at the Warrior 64, there's also Matt Strider, Matt Something Matt starts with an S. I've used him secondly. He, the, so he only posts with uh, PlayStation and Xbox uh, reach, uh, updates about like who's getting it, when it's gonna drop, and then he also does like live streams with the drop as it's happening, so that you can follow, so that you can follow along as well. And then there's like another one that's like um, Xbox stock uh, trader, or like I think it's like three more. Okay, hold on, I'm just gonna get this box out the way. Mm. The box is, is the literal same size as this thing. All right, mm. here we are. Series X, boy. Uh, spec stuff, and yeah, 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 yeah. So, I can't remember who's, um, ooh, power your dreams. Yes, I definitely will power my dreams. But I can't remember whose drop exactly it was. It wasn't Matt's, but it was someone else with the Xbox stock notif notification or whatever. Can't remember who. Oh, Sasha has a little fan. He's just easy to pull off. But I can't remember what exactly what it was, but I will uh, give them a link in the description uh, below so that you too, if you haven't got your Xbox Series X or Series S or PS5, you can follow those guys. And what I actually recommend doing, if you actually are legitimate, 100% serious, trying to focus on that you what i did i muted all of my other uh twitter accounts that i follow so all i would see is nothing but their notifications and updates filling up my feed it may be like you know a few gaps here in between because like it doesn't happen very often but when it does it would just be right there i follow them turn on the notifications for everything that they did and it was always like, oh, hey, this is uh, coming in, GameStop, Walmart, or whatever. Oh, the, the new uh, the new limited edition, the Halo 20th anniversary. And that's honestly, that was the only, okay, that was the first time I tried to do it. No, the first time I tried to do it was for the PS5 uh, digital version. Didn't uh, look on that one. 
And then the second time I tried to get the, the Halo anniversary version of this still, oh, there's still more tape on there. The second time I was trying to go for the, the limited edition one. And then the third time is when I got this one. I was actually aiming to get the anniversary, Halo anniversary, anniversary version. I was like, you know what? At this point, a Series X is a Series X. The only difference between this one and the uh, anniversary one is like, you know, the, the obvious looks. And I think it has like a special Halo theme turn on time. If there's some other stuff that I might be missing, then hey, I guess I'll be missing out. But I got my Series X and I could like, you know, put some stickers on it or whatever and customize it. But I probably won't. I just probably just like keep it black. <clears throat> all right. Now all the stickers are off. Let's open up this bad boy. Oh, ooh, okay. Oh, wow. And honestly, I don't think I've seen any... No, yeah, I did not see any other unboxing video for the XYZ S. I think I've seen like a, maybe like one teardown video, but I don't think I've even like seen too much in depth of it. And also here again, it says, uh, let me just do this carefully. Power your dreams. My dreams are definitely being powered. Let's uh, get you out of your sarcophagus. Oh, ooh, you got some weight. Oh my gosh, you got some weight. All right, which way is up? Which way is... Okay, so that little dip... Okay, yeah, that is definitely the platform. Platform, right here, on the bottom. That little dip part is right up up there. And then, let's see, what is in here? I honestly thought... Okay, this is like quick instructions. This thing right here. Yeah, getting started, quick instructions. Stop those right here. And I'm guessing like all the other accessories is... Okay, let me get this out the way, out of frame just a little bit okay so behind this part it's got to be like the other accessories and cords so i am just going to very carefully all right foam comes out i also like how they actually you know have this foam super fit in here because i don't remember exactly how it was for the oh yeah for the the xbox one x it wasn't really as padded with the foam it was like more cardboard related so i'm gonna put you back here Nice and safe. And then all the accessories right here. And carefully open you up. Go to high speed. Yep, because there's only HDMI cable. And this must be the, yep, the control. Is the controller smaller? It feels a lot smaller than I, whoa. That was, Ooh, okay. Of course, there's gonna come with batteries included. All right, let's move you out the way. Oh, ooh, you are textured down there. All right, it's textured right here. And, uh, it looks a lot smaller. Not gonna lie, it looks a whole lot smaller. It really, really does. Hold on. All right, so I have, mm, here's my OG Xbox One X, and here is the Series X. Uh, I think it has to, like, if I'm trying to, like, sit it side by side. Yeah, I think this Series X controller is, like, this a hair smaller. It feels a lot smaller, though. Mm. It's definitely lighter. Well, then again, it's probably because, like, there's, like, no, obviously no batteries in here. But even so, like, I think even like with the batteries, it would still like, still be hella light. All right, cool. So that's a uh, controller comparison. Let's put this dongle back on. How sick you right here, out the way for right now. All right, cool. So that's the controller. I'm gonna sit you on this nice soft pad. The batteries are here. Put you in the box. And then the other accessories, but you know what? And the accessories. I'm excited for the console itself. I just. Wanted to like, you know, get that out the way. I'll get back to this SUV in a minute, but let's get to the big boss. This guy right here. Uh, how do I check him? Oh my God. Man, I think I could, no, it's just a tape right here. Take it off. All right, open it up like a bag. Ooh. Yes, look at this. Oh, wait, nope. There we go. Look at this freaking monolith, this freaking mini fridge of a console. Oh my gosh, this thing is hefty. There we go, there we go. All right, cool. 
well, it's actually, now that I'm actually right up on it, it is pretty sizey. And I finally got this. Can't believe it. And got the Xbox logo. And I think this button itself is also smaller than the uh, the Xbox uh, Xbox One X. What else we got here? Let's see. So we got the front USB. That's the Bluetooth button. That's the obviously CD ejector. Mm. Turn it over. Man, you always hefty. All right, we got the fans. And this top part, they're all green in it. Honestly, I thought this whole green part, like when I first, we was, when I was first seeing the, uh, the images for this thing, I thought the green was like a light coming from like the console itself, but no, they just had like little green parts painted into it. So that shows that like, I really did not watch any unboxing videos, but I also, uh, had a, a time to play with uh, Jelani's Series X and I saw that for the first time. Yeah. All the USB hookups in the freaking power HDMI. Expanded storage, Ethernet, and two USBs. All right, and then also another. I don't know if you can see that. Let me just smooth it out the way. And got like screw shoe forward. Now I could probably like zoom in with editing magic, but like it says, Xbox right there. And this is just a beauty. You can stand it like this, or you know, it's got the little uh, pegs on the bottom. And you can play it like that. But, of course, we, we all know what the proper way how to play this thing. I mean, they advertise it vertically, so I'm going to play it vertically. It, it saves room, and it, it's just more aesthetically pleasing, you know? So, yeah. So, that is the console itself. And the controller is not, like, it's not the same type of black that the console itself is. It's like, you know, just slightly gray. And I may eventually uh, upgrade to an Elite controller. They got the Elite Series out too. Series 2 out right now. I may get that or I might get like a, a third party version of like the Elite Series 2. I will do some more research. But uh, yeah, here we are. My Xbox One Series X. And also, again, I will um, put down the links in the description of those uh, Twitter accounts that I followed closely to get a Series X. They will like do the whole restocks of uh, notifications and whatnot. They'll let you know when a restock is going to happen, what consoles, when it's dropping. And uh, like, and also of course, like they, they will let you know like, hey, like don't buy from Twitter and stuff or whatnot. That, that's pretty much all I have to give. But thank you for, if, even if you already saw an unboxing, if you came to see my unboxing, which is like years, two years by now, or like a year and a half late into the game, I still want to do this though, cause like this is my genuine, genuine uh, impression of like having this console, and I can't have uh, Final Fantasy well, go without a console unboxing of this one. And when I get my PS5, I will probably do another unboxing of that as well to put on the YouTube's. I want to thank you guys for clicking the video and for joining me for this uh, exciting adventure. It is obviously like late at night. I came off. I just came off of work about an hour ago. I got this, I got this like earlier today, well technically last night, I got it earlier today, but like didn't have time to do the whole unboxing. I wanted to save it till like later. So now it's later and better late than never. Thank you again for clicking the video. Thank you for coming along. If you want to see some more videos, which I will be pushing out uh, as much as possible uh, when I can, you know, of course you can find them right here on the YouTube. So you want to see where I'll be hiding around the internet. The links will be in the description below. Of course it includes Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, all that good jazz. And also you can find uh, Jelani and everybody else in the link in the descriptions as well. Um, thank you for joining yet again. Can't thank you enough. And I will see you guys on the flip side. And if you are still trying to uh, get yourself a console, PS5, Series X, S or whatever, I do wish you the best of luck. There is hope. As you go, obviously I finally got mine after like, you no know, years later, but there is hope for you to get one. Just follow the accounts. Uh, mute all the other accounts. It's only gonna be like muted for like 30 days, but it will really, really benefit you. And just like, just pay attention. Like when you get the notification on your phone, just hop right into it if you can. Like if you're too busy at work, or if you're like, don't, don't do it while you're driving either. But like if you're too busy or whatnot, just it's okay. There, there will be like another one, like within like the next two days. Like these things were coming back, were coming, showing up 
like back to back, like one day and then like they'll skip one day and then like the next day, like Monday and then not Tuesday, but then Wednesday. That's when they would do like another restock, small one, big one, either consoles. But there is hope as you can obviously, I am sorry, I'm scratching my leg. I probably got bit by some mosquitoes and didn't know it, but like there's obviously hope to getting a console at the original price. Do not cave in and shell out $800, $1,000 for the Series X or any other console or even the limited edition Halo 1. It is limited edition, but there's still a possibility for you to get those. Thank you for watching the video. Thanks for sticking to the end. I will see you guys in the flip side. This is Collier from Final Wombat signing out. And as always, stay awesome. Oh, and one more thing. Um, I will also be doing an impression of like my first impression. So like playing with this thing, like doing a whole dashboard there, but that'll be in another part. So yeah, just stick around for that. Collier from Final Wombat signing out. Peace.